Dbot visualization. By now you have noticed that Dbot has a lot of functions and there's still more to come. For now we're gonna take a look at the last one that we haven't covered yet, which are the visualizations of the OBS Clear browser plugins as well as the .txt files. Let's start with the OBS Clear browser plugin. If you go to the Dbot wiki, which you can find on the website and then press the link OBS plus clear browser, bro then you will get to this specific post. Over here you can download not only OBS, but also the clear browser plugin for the 32-bit and the 64-bit version. Underneath there you will find several kind of URLs. These URLs are for specific functions. The donation notification, sub notification and follower notification URLs are meant for these specific functions in the configuration tab. These are CSS style sheets. If you wish to learn more about them, please visit the previous shorts. The OBS, the OBS chat overlay is the external chat of your stream. You can also find this simply by going to the chat tab and then press external chat and then press the, the blue square over here. As last we have the drag race on screen display. This is for the minigame drag race and will display a couple of cars driving against each other as a visual aid. You can find this by simply clicking on the link over here at the drag race, then go to stream interaction and then click the preview button of the drag race. Next are the sub target tracker which is the subscribe a subscription tracker and is for Twitch partners only and the donation target tracker. The sub target tracker is to to see how fast you get your sub subscriptions or target up a couple amount of, subs of subscribers. Next is the donation target tracker which is used here at the donation target tracking. Both can be added to your clear browser plug plugin and can be reset at any time at the specific function. As last, you can CSS style sheet any way you want these specific functions within the browser options. You can find the CSS code underneath here. Next are the .txt files. Simply go to your local computer and go to the dbot folder. After this you can find the OBS folder and you will find a lot of .txt files. These .txt files do exactly what they say, including the YouTube current song as well as sub target or latest 5 or latest 5 subs. The YouTube current song or the exclamation mark song command works also with Spotify. However, the iTunes option will be removed after the next patch. The request song option regarding Spotify will not be available in DeepBot. This concludes this tutorial.